Mercedes is a very strong field. Um, a lot of good drivers, a lot of good teams still here. Especially now ELMS is the dominant LMP2 category and championship to be in. So um, the competition's great um, and it's awesome to be here with, with these guys. So um, the racing's uh, hard. Obviously here in Ricard, mixed conditions at the moment, but um, good preparation for, for Sunday as maybe the conditions are looking a little bit mixed. been doing uh, ELMS for uh, quite some years now always on the on the GTE side so it's great it's great to to finally get the, this uh, this change of machine so the LMP2 it's uh, it's great to drive I mean it's super funny and um, and super quick at the same time it's a superstar lineup you look at the field everyone's Everyone's very talented, incredibly quick, so I'm happy with the car, happy with my team. And yeah, sports car racing is quite fun with the traffic and everything involved. It's always exciting while you're driving, no boring laps. Obviously being the main event in European races is quite nice because even when you're in Formula 2, you always have the secondary paddock being the main event here is quite nice and it's very crowded. Barcelona was crazy and I hope it goes like this for the entire season. I think anyone is. Um, if you're certainly on the back foot like we were after race one, um, unfortunately we were out the race quite quickly uh, with some contact. But um, you know you need to take points at every race. I believe somewhere in the top four or five um, uh, would put you in a great position. But um, there will be people who will be trying to be consistent. Equally, there will be people trying to make up ground. And I think uh, when you come to race two already on such a short break, you want to maximise as much as you can. focus on uh, making every, everything else perfect you know at the end both me and my, and my two teammates are uh, rookies in the endurance racing world so we need to learn everything driver changes pit stop everything everything is new for us so it will probably take a, a little bit a, a little bit of time but I'm not concerned about pace for sure yeah round of the season in, in quite a short championship overall. Um, we, we personally are looking to continue our success that we had in Barcelona um, and with such a strong grid you can't afford to drop any points so yeah I think every race will be will be uh, a difficult one but for us we need to continue the success we have a lot of morale and uh, looking to get back into it in round two. It's um, the final race before Le Mans so we might have one test before but you won't have any potential qualifyings or anything like that before Le Mans. So yeah, there's a lot of prep here, getting back into it. It's nice to have a race, you know, this close before Le Mans. It's, it's not far away, which is exciting. That's going to be my eight times in Le Mans. So very happy and, and proud to be finally be there in the in the top class. So I will fight for the overall uh, classification this year. It's really important to try to get um, as many kilometers as possible before uh, the big event. I think uh, it's going to be a challenging, uh, challenging race, but a lot of fun at the same time.